A ball collides elastically with a stationary ball of same mass. It's given that angle of impact is alpha. We need to find the fraction of kinetic energy of the striking ball that turned into potential energy at the moment of the maximum deformation. So deformation is maximum when velocities of both balls along the line of collision will be equal. So this ball will keep pushing this ball until their velocities become equal. And after that, this ball will start to get released with higher velocity. So then the potential energy will start to convert into kinetic energy. So the potential energy is maximum when this object, the first ball keeps compressing into the second ball until their velocities become same. So that time the potential energy of the system will be minimum. Sorry, the kinetic energy of the system will be minimum and potential energy will be maximum. So let's find what is the fraction of kinetic energy. So first is of course we'll conserve our momentum in the direction where it is striking. So initial momentum in this direction is mu cos alpha and final momentum is 2m into v. And here I have directly written that because in this direction there is no force on the first ball so its momentum will be conserved of the system in this direction. So initial is uh, initial is equal to final which is u sin alpha. So its velocity in this direction will be same because it's only experiencing normal the force in this direction. Now this ratio which we need is PE upon KE initial. So this PE stored we can write as KE initial minus KE final which is 1 minus KE final by KE initial. So we write KE final for the whole thing. So of this mass in this direction so energy is half m into u square sin square alpha and in this direction for the combined mass it will be half 2m into v square. So value of v will put from here and you will see half m u square will get cancelled from both sides and you will be left with your answer cos square alpha by 